Every car enthusiast knows that some brands share the same engines. For example, Mercedes uses several Renault engines, Hyundai and Kia rely on very similar powertrains, and even some supercar brands use engines originally found in regular sedans like Audi and Lamborghini. In today's video, we're showing you 8 cars that surprisingly share their engines with 8 other models. Welcome to your channel Car Dude. Buckle up, hit the like button, subscribe, and let's enjoy this video. The Honda Civic Type R is a beautiful, small, fast, and surprisingly comfortable car. And even John Senna drives it as his daily car. My daily driver is a um, Civic Type R. Shut up. It's got tech. It's manual. Shut it's reliable. Up. The car is stable at 100. That's every day. That's what I can catch you Dude, on. Dude, it's a 2020 and it's got a third pedal. My dog. And at 145, it's stable. But what may surprise you is that this car shares its engine with a model many people have never heard of. The Ariel Atom Ferrar. The Atom is an ultra-lightweight, race car-like machine. Both the Civic Type R and the Ariel Atom Ferrar use the same engine, the Honda K20C1, a 2.0-liter turbocharged unit. In the Honda, it produces about 306 horsepower, but in the Ariel Atom Ferrar, after tuning, it pushes up to 400 horsepower and thanks to the lightweight body, the performance becomes absolutely wild. The second engine on our list is shared between two completely different cars. One is an economical daily car, and the other is a sporty machine capable of embarrassing supercars. The Toyota Camry, the number one economical car known for its reliability and durability. And on the other side, the beautiful and sporty Lotus Emira. Both cars use the same engine, the Toyota Tegi RFE, a 3.5-liter V6 engine developed by Toyota. Lotus took this engine and upgraded it heavily, most importantly by adding a supercharger, transforming it from a quiet and calm engine in the Camry into an absolute beast with an amazing sound in the Lotus Emira. The Volvo XC90 is a safe, family-friendly SUV that's excellent for long trips and known for its reliability. What many people don't know is that it had a V8 version built by Yamaha, the famous Japanese motorcycle manufacturer. Surprisingly, this same engine is shared with a British company called Noble, in their supercar, the Noble M600. A car that isn't very famous, but is extremely fast. Noble took the same Yamaha engine found in the XC90 and added twin turbos, boosting the power to around 650 horsepower, allowing the car to hit 0 to 60 miles per hour in under 3 seconds. <laughs> The Audi S8 and the Lamborghini Gallardo. At first glance, you'd never think they share anything in common. But surprisingly, they share the most important component of all, the engine. The Audi S8 is a luxury sedan competing with the S-Class. Despite being a comfortable and high-tech car, it is powered by a legendary 5.2-liter V10 engine. This same engine is found in the car that changed Lamborghini's modern history, the Lamborghini Gallardo. However, Lamborghini upgraded and tuned it to produce around 560 horsepower, along with a distinctive and beautiful sound. We all know the famous police car, the Ford Crown Victoria, and it's well known for a 0.6-liter V8 engine reliable, strong, and trusted. But the surprise is that the first car from the hypercar manufacturer Koenigsegg actually used this engine. The car is the Koenigsegg CC85. Imagine a hypercar using an engine from a relatively affordable sedan. Koenigsegg didn't leave the engine stock, they made major upgrades, including adding a supercharger, installing a custom cooling kit, other performance enhancements, this transformed the engine from 240 horsepower in the Ford to around 655 horsepower in the Koenigsegg CC85, turning it into a true beast on the road. Germans and Italians have some kind of agreement. Mercedes and Pagani also use the same engine, 
with some modifications. The Mercedes W140 A600 and the Pagani Zonda share the same engine. The Mercedes S600 was the most luxurious car of its time, packed with advanced systems and features, powered by a 6.0-liter V12 producing over 500 horsepower offering impressive acceleration despite its heavy weight. Pagani, on the other hand, took the same engine and placed it in their rare and unique Zonda, handcrafted masterpiece, adding special modifications to produce an amazing and distinctive sound, unlike any other car. Everyone loves BMW and everyone dreams of owning a McLaren. But did you know that the BMW 850 CSI and the McLaren F1 share the same engine? The BMW 850 CSI was a luxurious, fast, and unique car, one of the most premium BMWs of its time, powered by a 5.6-liter V12 producing 375 horsepower. McLaren, in its legendary F1, used the same engine but with a completely different setup, performance, and experience. They increased the displacement to 6.1 liters, producing 627 horsepower, all naturally aspirated. The McLaren F1 was the fastest car in the world at the time, reaching a top speed of 386 kilometers per hour, which is about 240 miles per hour. The Chevrolet Tahoe, a massive, spacious family SUV, and one of my dream cars, it's comfortable and comes with a large V8 engine. But there's another version of the Tahoe equipped with the V8 LS, one of the most powerful engines from General Motors. The surprise is that this engine was also used in Altima TR. Not this Altima, but this Altima, extremely light and built for performance and speed. This Altima TR can reach 0 to 60 miles per hour in under 3 seconds, and in some unofficial tests, it even outperformed Bugatti. This was the first part of the video, if you enjoyed it and want to see part 2, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and comment below which car surprised you the most.